Prophet Anthony here. And I just want to give you some advice. Maybe a, a, wor a, a warning, a quick warning. Stay away from the TikTok lives that has drop your name. Drop your name. And I'm going to tell you about yourself. Drop your name and I'm going to give you a prophecy. You see, the spirit of the Lord, the spirit of the true and living God does not operate like this. Drop your name. God does not need a name. God does not need your name just to, to prophesy to you, just to give you a word. If you need a word, pray to the Lord, man. See God. He will, he will give. He is the word. He is the word. But I'm just saying there has been like a major influx, a major increase of like false prophets, man. They are they are not uh, delegated by God. They're not sent by God. They just took on the title of prophet, but they're not real prophets. Real prophets will not tell you just to give give me your name. That's not the spirit of God. That is not the spirit of God. That's either a psychic or that's a divination. That's either a psychic or divination, which is really witchcraft. Yeah, I'm just giving you some advice to stay away from these people asking you to drop your name. Okay, it's 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 a lot of people that's doing this, man. It's a lot of people that's doing it. So I'm just like uh, giving you advice, and I'm telling you, the spirit of the Lord does not work like this. Prophecy does not work like that. I don't know. I don't. I don't know. But Jesus did tell us that there are going to be people, people being false prophets. You know, God has a kingdom. The devil has a kingdom too. God has ministers. The devil has ministers too. God got people that that's standing and going hard for Him, and the devil that's uh, got people that's st standing and going hard for Him too. But do not be deceived. This is where you have to have discernment. Don't let these people prophesy lie to you. Have discernment. If you don't have, I tell you, ask God for wisdom. And then ask God for the discernment. And then another thing, he says, test the spirit or try the spirit to see if it's of God, test the spirit, test and see if it's lining up with the word of God. If it's not lining up with the word, it's not of God. It's not by God. That's my message.